the father will take the police spirit away from him. Who are you to ignore him? I'm done. Yeah. And see, now you can do the crossfire. My brother, you are failing. This guy is failing. He, he, no, I'm joking. He's, he's failing. He's, he's failing thing. miserably here. Thanks. That's why I said, I'm not telling people, I'm going to give you Bible lessons. And you can see, you are here, here, here. You can't call Jesus. Look at your laugh. Listen to me. I ask you. No, okay, let me, you've lost them. Who's lost it? He's you came to attack. He's standing. I can attack. They can defend. Okay. Let me tell you what Islam is all about. Wait, wait. No, 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 no question. No question. Okay, that means you come to attack Islam. Let me, let me, let me. One second. One second. You know any other Christian? You know any other Christian? You don't want to No, I don't. You don't. Tell me what Islam is. I want to know. No question. We don't want that. No, 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 no. That's not important. If you answer that question, that's not important. No, no. That's not important. You know why it's not important. You know why it's not important. I tell you. I tell you. I tell you why it's not important. Wait. Why is it important? Wait to me. Can you listen? Can you listen? Listen to me. What is what is not important? You know what you know what is important to us? Listen to me. You are a Christian. You don't know. Everyone can study. Okay. Wonders of God. Don't hit me. No, 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 no. I'm not hitting you. I'm not going to. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Listen to me. Calm down. Who is screaming here before I came? Calm down. I just came with the kid. I'm sorry for shouting. You've been screaming at the brothers. I'm sorry for shouting. I tell you, I'm louder than you. I'm sorry for shouting. Calm down. Yeah, yeah. No, no. I'm calm down. Easy. Okay, calm. Let's calm. Let's calm down. Okay. Calm, calm, calm. Okay. Calm down. Sure. So calm, calm. Look, look. Listen to me. You came here. You are asking questions, you want people to answer. I ask you, do you know anything about Islamic or no? Let's start from the basic. You from Africa, Ghana, you don't know your Christianity, you don't know about Islam, let you come to attack Islam. You don't know anything about faith. Go and study your faith first. What is Christianity first? Is that, is that what you can tell me? That's important. So is that the answer no, no, to my question? It's important. That that I, I, will answer it. I will answer it. I, you, I don't have uh, the whole world. I don't have all the time. What is important? Straight to the point. No, not to the point. No, no. Straight to the but point. But you don't know anything about Islam. How can you call the Quran? You see, look, you are disappointed. You don't. Of them there. Who? You are disappointed. You, you, are, you, are, you, are, you are a shame to Christianity. A shame to Christianity. You don't know anything about Christianity. You said it. You said it. You said it. You said it. Uh, you don't know you anything. Know you, you don't. Know no, I never, never said that. I said you, know, you, 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 know, know you know your faith. Oh. You know everything. You do know your faith. I know my faith. Nobody know. No, you're, you don't. You don't know. You, you don't know. I know you don't question. know. You don't know. Answer the question. No, that's not important. Answer the question. You say my question is not okay, important. Okay. Okay. Hey, so listen. Oh, no. You see me. My question is not important. Brother, 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 listen to your question. Ask, ask. Can you answer the question? No, no. Answer the question. Answer it. Answer the question. Listen. My question is that. He says, not me. The, okay. <laughs> what did he say? He didn't, oh, no, no, what did he say? Yeah, not me before I okay. came. Do what did he say? Agree the question, the initial Quran, question. Wait, no, 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 yeah. And I said the Quran was revealed in the Prophet Muhammad uh -huh. Sallam, through the angel but Gabriel. Think, wait, wait, and then he yeah, said, no, why said, the matter of the no, breast suckling is not in the Quran? No, wait, no, no, but you, you, well, why is it not yeah, there? Well, who, yeah, so be honest yeah, yeah. to ask. Well, so why is it not there? What do you, because if Allah himself, imagine, <laughs> Allah himself <laughs> oh, has to do something, Shaitan. then no <laughs> human being decides to take it out. Why is it not there? What is the Bible? Why is it the issue of the breast suckling? I want to export to wait. Yeah, 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 go on. How can you and me and one be like this? Take exposed. away what Allah has revealed. Don't yeah. be so greater than Allah. That's what I'm trying to tell Allah. Can I answer? I'm sorry, brother. Yeah. Uh, our our prophet, listen, brother. Listen, brother. Listen, brother. Hey, our prophet. <laughs> You're a joke. Our prophet. <laughs> tell, us, tell us the truth, the way, the lie. This our prophet. Tell us. So if it's not in the Quran, I will ask you a specific question. Don't talk about prayer. You see, I said in the Quran, it's not in the Quran. You see how they pray. Sucking of the bread. They go to anti Islamic websites. Come out the way here today. Get the information from and come here to talk about Islam. Why are you assaulting that? Who is assaulting you? Who is assaulting? Five minutes is too much. Look, you don't even have a watch. How are you? No, no, no. You are spamming me. Brother, brother, brother. I think you are making a fool of yourself. Five minutes is too much. You know what? 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 You speak out, sir? I don't speak out. I don't speak Bandi. I don't speak Wolof. I play my. I speak my Nigerian Wolof. No, no, no. Yeah, what? No, 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 Listen to me. 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 Wait, 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 wait. You're making a fool of yourself. You're fool. 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 You're
and the question you are being a fool. Do you know what you know? What do you know? You are just dodging the question. No, 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 no. Keep dodging the question. They come here. Why is the issue not in the Quran? No, no, sir. Why is the issue? How am I talking the Quran? What is the issue? that you didn't put something in the Quran. I'm going to restore the Quran. No, no, no. Tell me about the Quran. I said this. No, tell me about the Quran. This book. I can't tell you about the Bible. Tell me. No, 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 no. It's translation. Can read it. Tell me something. Tell me something. Allah revealed. Do you agree Allah revealed this book? Do you agree? This is a translation, yes. Do you agree Allah revealed it? I read the Quran. You believe that everything that Allah revealed is good for you? Of course. Yes. Okay. So, so if there is evidence that a mere human being a mere human being has taken something away from the Quran. That would that bother, bother you? Wait, 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 can you debate? <laughs> you can't debate. <laughs> you can't debate. You can't debate. Hold your Bible. Let's debate. Let's debate. You can't. Ask your question. Ask your question. Let's debate. Let's debate. No. <laughs> yeah. 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 I said let's debate. You have disgraced all Muslims in the world. Who? Because you can't answer Christian. one simple question. My guy named Quran is like a fool of himself. Thank you very much. He doesn't know about his faith. Came to Islam. He doesn't know anything about Islam. No, you can't. You can't. You can't. I can't answer. You can't. Anything. Ask you one question. You can't. And the Bible, your your hadith says that what you get from. Where did you get it from? 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 Look, look at this nonsense. Hey, 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 you are laughing. You are making a fool of yourself. You are making a fool of yourself. Where, where? Where did you get it from? Where? Tell me where. Shout out to you. Where, where, where? Where? Where did you get it from? The cameras are seeing you. They are seeing you quietly. They are seeing you quietly. People are seeing that you are making a fool of yourself. Okay, we see this because of yourself. You cannot Islam. You don't know anything about your Bible. That's all right. That's all right. Nothing about Quran. You've done well. Tell me about Quran. Tell me about Quran. Tell me about Quran. You don't know. Call one verse on the Quran. Let's talk about Bible. Let's talk about Bible. They go to ask you something where they want to. Come here. Let's talk about Bible. One question. One question. One question. One question. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Do that away. Let's debate. 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 Why shouting? Let's debate. Why shouting? One more second. Let's debate. Let's debate. Why shouting? Let's debate. 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 Let's debate.
child. As a simple boy. You're a child. You still can't. I'm older than you. I'm older than you. What is the answer? What is the answer? Look, end of time. It's a waste of time. It's a waste of time. It's a waste of time. Tom was the Quran. I'm giving you the analogy. Tom was the Quran. Let me finish. Let me finish. The Bible says that Jesus was Moses and the way and the life. And our Islam, Quran is our our truth and the way and the life. And if it's not there, wait, 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 wait. If it's not says in the Quran, it's in the Hadith. I saw so did, did Allah reveal things? Did Allah, Allah reveal things in the Hadith? In the Quran, he did, 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 did Allah reveal things in the Hadith? No, he doesn't. Did, did Allah reveal things in the Hadith? He's empty. Allah reveal things in the Hadith. You're empty. No, Allah. Thank you, bro. Lack of knowledge. Did Allah reveal things in the Hadith? You know why? Did Allah reveal things in the Hadith? Yes or no? You know why the British people colonized your country? Because people like you. It's easy people like you. You're so empty. You can't debate. You must say let's debate. You believe in the Quran? No, you believe in the Bible. Even your language, you forgot. Did Allah do something? Do something in the Hadith? No, come on. Yes or no? He answered. Teach me. Okay. Allah is here too. Allah guides the prophets. Oh, it's just the Quran or the Bible. Who's the word of God? Yes, the Bible is a guide. He's here. Look, you don't believe in the Bible. No, you don't believe in the Bible. No, no, no. You believe in the Bible. Of course. You believe in the Bible. Okay. The Quran, the Quran or the Bible. Which is the word of God? Let's debate. 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 Calm down. Let's debate. Let's debate the word of God, which is my word. I said, let's debate. What topic do you want to debate on? Sorry. What word debate? The whole book. The whole book. Cannot be the whole book. No, no, no. You choose the topic. No, no, no. No. So what word do you want to debate on? I said the Quran or the. No, you're attacking the Quran. Yes, yes. The Quran. The Quran. Or the Bible. The Bible. The Word of God. Annoying everything. Let's debate. Listen. What Come topic on. do you want to debate? About I Jesus. I don't want you to. About Jesus. What is the word of God? About okay, Jesus. Okay, okay. I don't want to do it. He said I'm talking about you. About Jesus. Wait, wait. Wait, wait. You know, wait, wait. Which topic? Okay, wait, wait, wait. Which topic? About Jesus being God. The most important. Which topic? Let me tell you. I'll tell you why. When you come here, we have. Let me tell you. The most important debate that we come here is one that's of God. The concept of God in Islam versus the concept of God in Christianity. Okay. And then yeah. Is that what you want? You can start with that. Because Bible start. Which part of Bible don't you agree with? No, no. Which part of Bible don't you agree with? I said let's debate. Yes, so yeah, we have a moderator. So the person who couldn't answer me. So no, we have a moderator. Okay. It's not a question, it's a debate. Start. All right. I listen. Can you debate? Two minutes. I listen to you. Don't ask, it's a debate. I listen. During the debate, you can't listen to me. You know you don't listen. I listen to me. I go to debate. I listen to you. Yes, I debate it. I said. Which part of the Bible do you agree He's with? in the debate. Who do you do it in the debate? Now, who's okay, the child okay, is here? No, because if I quote something in the Bible, you tell me that you don't agree with that one. Um, no, so no, tell no, me which are no, 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 listen to me. Uh -huh. Okay, listen to me. We said Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is one, one Lord. Okay, one listen Lord. to me, listen okay. to me. Okay. He's the creator. Uh -huh. Yeah, self-sufficient, uh -huh. you know, uh -huh. he's not need to do anything, okay. he create everything alone. Okay. And we must say Allah the creator, the creation. Okay. You believe in Jesus, mm -hmm. you believe in Jesus, maybe you're still in Jesus is God or Son of God. He came uh -huh. to die and on the, the sin of mankind. And the spirit is also God. Okay, the spirit is also God. So let's debate with that. What I'm saying, okay. so three minutes, one, one, three minutes, okay. three minutes. Okay. 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 We have a moderator. Are you sure? I'm getting somebody from the moderator. We have a moderator. Yeah. Can you have a moderator? Three minutes each. We're gonna have time here, three minutes each. Okay. And don't run away. Okay. Maybe half an hour. Half an hour, yeah. We'll see whether you know the Bible. The and by the time okay. I finish okay. with you, I'm gonna inshallah give you Bible lessons. And from today, maybe inshallah you'll never come behind again. Let's start. Let's do that. Let's do that. Come on. How long is it? Three minutes or two minutes? Two minutes or three minutes? Two minutes or three minutes? Two minutes or three minutes? Three minutes, make it three minutes. Two or two minutes. No, three minutes, go three minutes. We go for half an hour, three minutes. It's very good, three minutes. No shouting, no screaming. We give up. Yeah. Ship here. Okay, you ready? Yeah. Got it, ready? Let's shoot. Ready, yeah, hold on. Okay, you can start. Go. Drop his What's your name? Not important. Yeah. Not Go. important. You can start. Mr. Ghana. You, 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 you start. 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 You from, my name is Lamin. What's your name? Mohammed Lamin. Stanley. 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 Stanley from Ghana. I'm from Gambia. Inshallah, I'm a Muslim. I've been coming here for years now doing dawah. So today, this man here, when I came here, he was attacking the Quran, asking questions. So now we're going to have a proper debate. Oneness of God in Islam, that's the oneness of, oneness of God in Christianity. Three minutes in, and we're going to go about half an hour, inshallah. By the time I finish with him, he'll get a Bible lesson. Now we'll know whether this man knows his Bible. So, Islam, as I said, I've been saying here, simply mean submitting one's will to Almighty God, Allah. We the Muslims, we worship 
Allah the creator, not the creation. And as I said several times here, the Quran has got 100, 140 surahs. You call it chapters. From the first surah, which is surah al-Fatiha, to the last surah, surah al-Nas. 140 surah. Now, if you want to know about the concept of God in Islam, the best surah to go to is surah, surah class, which is the 112 surah. I'm going to quote that now first. Inshallah. He said, I said, Allah Say, He's Allah the one. Allah who summat. Allah the absolute, the eternal. Allah who is self sufficient, who is not in need of anything. Allah upon whom we all depend. He begets not, no, he's begotten. He has no parents, no children. And there is nothing unto like him. We, the Muslims, we believe in all the prophets. And we do not make any distinction between any of the prophets. We are telling the Christian brothers here, Isa alayhi salam, Jesus, with the qualities of him, was only the Messiah sent to the children of Israel. He never said he is God, he never said, Worship me. Nowhere in the Bible where Jesus said, He's God, worship me. They also believe in Trinity. As he said, now earlier on, the Father is God, the Son is God, and the Holy Ghost is God. But there are not three God, one God. The Father is eternal, the Son is eternal, and the Holy Ghost is eternal. The Father is almighty, the Son is almighty, and the Holy Ghost is almighty. And they believe that these three are one. These three are co-equal or co-eternal, and they're involved in the creation. What I'm challenging here, I'm going to go to the Quran and tell you, Allah said, He's the creator. Very important. If you want to know about who is God, the best thing is the creator. Who is the creator? We say Allah is the creator. I can quote the Quran and quote extensively. Allah is the creator. We will see whether we'll be able to go to the Bible and show a single verse where Jesus said he is God or worship me, who is the creator. Who wanna know? If you read the God's Quran. Allah said in Surah Al Baqarah, chapter number two, verse number. 117 said he is the originator of the heavens and the earth when he decrees the matter he only says the kum fayakun be it is for a moment go you say how about time yeah it's time it's done yeah go yeah it's quite interesting that instead of he proving to me he was preaching to me so in 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 same manner i'm not here to argue with him but to teach him right and I believe in the Bible. Before we started this debate, I asked him, Do you, which part of the Bible don't you believe? Because I'm going to use the whole of the Bible to prove my point. He couldn't tell me which, which, which part of the Bible he doesn't believe in. Because in his Quran, he's been asked to believe in the, in the Bible. All right, so let me tell you something. In Genesis chapter 1, the Bible says that in the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. The word, the original word there is Elohim. And Elohim there is a plural word. Then if you come to... Genesis chapter 1 verse 26 it says that and God said let us create man in our image let us create man in our image so if my brother here is saying that God is the creator of the heavens and the earth I agree with him but he said let us create man in our image Right. Real love, respect, brother. Real love, respect. I'll come to that. I know. Please, I'll when you're to talking, I, nobody said anything. No, nobody. You see, this is the discipline I expect from people. This is the discipline I I expect from people. I've been here for seven years. I know everything. Right. I know yet. Yeah. Okay. Leave it to me. Then, then again, then again, when Moses met the burning bush, what did they say? He said that if you go to Pharaoh, what do you tell him in um, Exodus chapter three, verse twenty? He said. If you go tell Pharaoh that I am that I am sent you, do you agree? And I am I, I am that I am sent you. Do you know where again you hear you saw the word I am in John chapter eight? Um, um, in John, Jesus told the people that before Abraham, I am. If you look at it carefully, I think he made a mistake because it was all in the past tense. So, no, 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 wait, wait, okay, 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 when you are talking, I didn't say talking, anything. Okay, okay, please, you guys. But I you said, engage with others. No, 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 I didn't engage. Go, 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 but I thought we all respected okay, each other. Okay, okay, yeah. before, before Abraham, I am. So it's just he only referred to us in what happened in Exodus that he said before Abraham. And we know that Jesus Christ lived way after Abraham. Abraham died. 
by oh. the reason why it's not a mistake is because he said before Abraham your father because in Jewish culture Abraham is their father because he was the patriarch of the whole nation of Israel but I said, before your father that you respect so much, I am. And Abraham that same I am is what... Um, hmm? He said, um, Judaism... God told like, Moses... Abraham was the father. The, That's wrong. In the Bible. Abraham, then let us come down again. Judah. Before I end, I'll ask him one simple question. Then when Jesus Christ was about to die, when, when he died and he resurrected, he said, go ye into the world, baptizing people in the name of God the Father and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. So this is to tell you that in this sense, Jesus Christ put himself in the same equal with the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. And you... All right. You see, the man, I can see that he has his studies, his Bible, in fact. That's what I'm saying. He said Exodus, Exodus, Exodus 3.20, when God sent uh, Moses to the Israelites. It's not Exodus 3.20. You got it wrong. Exodus 3.15. Read your Bible. All right. You caught it wrong. And that verse, in fact, let me know what happened. That verse, Exodus 3.20, Exodus 3.15. In your Bible, God sent Moses to, uh, to Pharaoh. What he said is that go to, he said to, uh, no, God sent Moses to the children of Israel. He said, uh, go to the children of Israel and say to them that your fathers, yeah, tell them that, that the God of your fathers, the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, the God of Jacob has sent me to you. That is not Jesus, because when you go to the New Testament, Jesus is a servant of that God. Now, if Jesus is a servant of God, how can he be God? You remember, God said, you go to the Israelites, say to Moses, tell them that the God of your fathers, the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, the God of Jacob has sent me to you. Now, when you go to the New Testament in Acts 3.13, you know what he said? Acts 3.13, he said, the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, the God of Jacob, the God of our fathers glorified his servant Jesus. So the God of Abraham, Isaac and Jacob is not Jesus. Jesus is a servant of the God. So read your Bible. Yeah. So. I'm going to go to Quran first. I'm going to the Bible. I said, don't run away. I'll come to the Bible extensively and 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 and, and uh, debunk this myth of Jesus being God and Trinity. Now, in the glorious Quran, if you read the glorious Quran, in Surah Al Anbiya, chapter number 25, chapter number 21, verse number 25, Allah said to Prophet Matthew on him, uh, "Not a messenger did we, that is Allah, send before you, without this inspiration, sent by us to him that there is no God but I." Therefore, worship and serve me alone. Every single messenger that came was given that message. All the prophets in your old in the testament, in the old testament, were all Muslims, they all submit their will to Almighty God. Now I want you to show me a single verse in the Old Testament where any of the prophets worship Jesus or knew anything about Trinity, the Father, the Word, and the Holy Ghost. You can't. None of the prophets in the Old Testament were Trinitarians, they are all Muslims. Sister. Now let's go to the Bible because I know the Quran, everybody knows. We worship Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, He's the creator, created everything. Now let me quote one more verse about who is the creator so that you know in the Golos Quran. If you read the Golos Quran, you say, oh, quick. Is it finished? Yeah? 30 seconds. 30 seconds. No, seconds. I'll give it to him, then I'll come to the Bible again, give you a Bible lesson. I'll give you one more and I'll come to the Bible lesson now because he quoted certain verses where Jesus said to the disciples, go and baptize them, you know. You quoted uh, that is uh, you know even nowhere in the Bible in Matthew, Matthew, yeah, Matthew twenty-eight, uh, nineteen. I'm going to come and quote that to you and put it's the context. Go. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, yeah. Is it? Yeah. Go. Let me go now. That's the thing. You come to the Bible lessons now. Go. It's your turn. Go. Yeah. You see, one, one, once again, instead of he appealing to his Quran, he was still appealing to the Bible because obviously. He hasn't got much to say in the Quran. No, so he's like, oh. Bible. Yeah. No, no, go. Let, let, when let, he's go. talking, I don't talk. No, Just the let, discipline let, I talk about. Let, let, let talk. Discipline. Talk. Discipline. Talk. talk. So once again, he was coming back to the Bible again to talk about the Bible. And he said, who, which prophet in the Old Testament spoke about Jesus Christ? I'm sorry to disappoint you, there is. If you read Psalm 110, David said, My Lord said to my Lord, sit at my right hand. Till I make your enemies your fools too. Who in the Bible said he was going to the Father to sit at his right hand side? David. <laughs> you see, so here David clearly 
Yeah. Was speaking uh, was speaking about the son no, he of God. No, he was. Okay. This, please, okay. please, okay. please okay. display yeah. for me, okay? Please, yeah. please display yeah. for me. Let me let me finish. Uh, so you can see clearly. Go on, go on. You said nobody in the Old Testament spoke about Jesus, and now this is somebody speaking about Jesus. He said, "My Lord, said to my Lord." David said, "My Lord, said to my Lord." So he's talking about three different lords over here, and he said that my Lord said, to "My Lord, sit at my right hand side." And who is, at, who, who is at the Father's right hand side? It says, good to make your enemies into your, your foods too. So it is very clear that you don't understand the Bible and you are just quoting the Bible. And in Isaiah, he said, Unto us a child is born, unto us a son is given. Or right, let's assume only children get born, right? To a son, a son is given. And the government shall be upon his shoulders, and he shall be called Wonderful Counselor. Everlasting Father, the Prince of Peace. Which human being can you? And the Mighty God. And the Mighty God. How do you? How do you ascribe such things to a normal human being? Because I'm sure in Islam, if I say this to you, you say that is haram. But if the Bible is ascribing that to a human being, who is that human being that the Bible was confident to ascribe such serious accolades to? It must be somebody who is not just a normal human being. So now I've given you two instances where a prophet spoke in the Old Testament, spoke about Jesus. I'm yeah. done. These verses he's quoting has nothing to do with Jesus. Period. As I 9, 6, and then I go to the Psalms as well. Look, I told you, none of the prophets, God from the beginning, you're telling me God from the beginning, told all the prophets, all, all, all the one God. Then later on, after Jesus left his world, he said he's three in one. Jesus never said he's never same. You can go to the word of Jesus. Jesus was, when he was on the earth, he never said he is God. He never said, worship me. Even when after Jesus left his world, after he left this world, the disciples were preaching. Why didn't they preach that Jesus was God or Trinity? But instead, in the book of Acts, chapter number two, verse number 22, you know what Peter said? Peter, the right hand man of Jesus. After Jesus left this world, the head of the disciples, know what he did? That's why I say you haven't read your Bible. If Jesus was God, Peter would have said that. No, he said, he went and addressed the crowd. No, he said, Acts 2 22, he said, Oh, men of Israel. Because maybe he knew that after Jesus left this world, people would worship him because of the miracles he was performing. You know what he said? Oh, men of Israel, hear these words. Jesus of Nazareth, a man, a man attested to you by God with mighty works and wonders and signs which God did through him and your witness to it. Tell me why. When Jesus left this world, disciples, if he was God, they would have preached that. And also in the book of Acts, chapter number five, verse number 42, you know what I said? The disciples, he said, day after day, from temple to temple and from house to house, they never stopped proclaiming the good news that Jesus is the Messiah. Not God incarnate, my brother, read your Bible. You are following the church fathers. Jesus, in several verses in your Bible, Jesus is telling you he was sent by God. God, I want to call, call Jesus now. Tell me why Jesus demonstrated this divinity. You read your Bible. In your Bible, John, you believe in John 8 40. John 8 40, when his enemies wanted to kill him. What did Jesus say? Jesus said, But now you seek to kill me, a man who has told you the truth which I have from God. With God. Read your Bible, John again, Gospel of John, chapter 8, verse number 42. Jesus said, If God were your father, you love me. For I have come here from God. I have not come on my own. God sent me. Who sent Jesus? Did he send himself? Oh, bro, read your Bible. He's quoting Isaiah 9 6. You know, if you understand Isaiah 9 6, Isaiah 9 6 has nothing with Jesus. He said, He will be called. That son will be called Mighty God, Everlasting Father. You are blaspheming. Jesus is mighty God. Nowhere. Only the Father is called mighty God. Do you know where? You read the everlasting. You read the Bible. In your Bible, in the Gospel of uh, Luke. Gospel of Luke, chapter number 22, verse number 69. He said, and we see that the Son of Man, that the Son of Man, that is Jesus, will be seated at the right hand of the mighty God. No, who is seated at the right hand of the mighty God in heaven? Tell me. In heaven. Who is the mighty God? Read your Bible. Go. Your time is up. You see, he asks me a question and I address his question. And instead of he coming back, he went into other areas. That is very classic of people like, like him. He said nobody in the Old Testament. Yeah. Oh, come on. Go, go. Discipline. Go. Discipline. 
Go, talk, talk. He said nobody, no prophet in the Old Testament spoke about Jesus. And I just proved to you, my Lord said to my Lord. And there you've not been able to touch it. You've been run away, switching, um, quoting everything except addressing this simple thing. And I told you, you can call me blasphemous. That's, that's fine. But I'm only quoting what's in my Bible. My Bible says that he is mighty God. That person is a mighty God. I didn't write it. If I wrote it, then that's fine. But if I didn't write it, who are you to come and say I'm blasphemy? You see, so your problem is that you are afraid to tackle the Bible as it is, it is, it is so, supposed to. And you are just beating about the bush. You understand? So that is your problem. Your problem. That's what I mean. Even that three minutes, I don't even need, need all the all the three minutes. I've just laid to you what the Bible says, and you are just beating about the bush. And one last question I would like to ask you. One last question I would like to ask you. We are debating. We are debating. No, finish your talk. We are debating. I didn't ask you a question. Finish. No, no, I'm not saying answer. I'm not answering. I'm, I'm not saying answer. answer, answer, answer no, 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 finish. No, 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 no ask questions. No, I was talking. Ask me to stop. Let's. I want to give a Bible lesson. Finish first. All right. I want to address so, your points. So finally, before I finish, I would, I would like to ask you: Can your good deeds Got save it. you? Are your good deeds good enough for God to save you? That's what I'm going to ask. I'm done. You don't you see. Let's read Isaiah 9 6. I'll address your point. Uh -huh. Because I'm talking, but you're not listening. I said in meaning, no, there is not none of the prophets in the Old Testament knew anything about Jesus being God or Trinity. That's what I said. None of them, that's what I said. No prophet in the Old Testament was it a triune God. That's what listen to me. That's what I said. I said, show me a single prophet in the Old Testament who was it Jesus or knew anything about Jesus being God uh, or a triune God. That's what I said. And you can't be fairly miserable. That's what I said. You can go back and show me again. None. All the prophets were Muslims. They all submitted they were with the Almighty God. All of them were sent to their people to preach this Islamic monotheism. The Almighty God is one Lord and they should stop worshipping idols and human beings and worship the Creator. Yeah? So here, Isaiah 9, 6. You, it, it seems as if you have wisdom. Isaiah 9, let's read it. Isaiah 9, 6 says, please. For us, a child is born. To us, a son is given, and the government will, will be, government will be on his shoulders, mm -hmm. and he will be called Wonderful Counselor. He will be called Mighty God, Everlasting Father, Prince of Peace. Now, show me a single verse from the Bible where any of the disciples, Jesus' mother, anybody called Jesus a Mighty God, Everlasting Father. You can't, you're laughing. It's a prophecy. You're laughing. It's a prophecy. I read it. Everybody can see it's a prophecy. He will be called now. Now only the fa only the father in the Bible, yeah, is called a uh, mighty God, everlasting Father. No, Jesus. He can't. Who is called mighty God? Who is sitting at the right hand of the mighty God in heaven? Who? Jesus, the Father. You see, this is a problem with this Trinitarian. See, look, look. We are inviting you to read all the prophets. All the prophets are Muslims. They all submit to Almighty God. Jesus, he cannot call Jesus. I've been mean, called the word of Jesus. Did he say he's God? Did he say worship me? You said he fully God, fully man, part of the Trinity. Yeah? God, Jesus said, I can of myself do nothing. John 5 30, I can of myself do nothing. As I hear, I judge, and my judgment is just because I seek not of my own will, but the will of him who sent me. God. God saying that. It's incredible. If Jesus was subservient to Almighty God, how can he be God? You see, this is, this is just, uh, you know, throughout the Bible, New Testament, Jesus is telling you, I was sent by God. Yeah? Everything I say for Almighty God. John 5. Yeah, John, you call John 12, 49 and 50. Jesus said, John 12, 49 and 50. Jesus said, I have not spoken of myself, but the Father which sent me, he gave me a commandment, what I should say and what I should preach. And I know that his commandment is life ever everlasting. Whatsoever I speak, therefore, even as the Father said unto me, so I speak. Call for me what Jesus, I want the word of Jesus. The man on the earth taught his disciples three and a half years. Never said, I am God. Never said, he is God. Never said, worship me. Never said anything about Trinity. Call Jesus now, let me see.
Let's see what Jesus said. Everything I, everything I asked him, he never addressed it. He said in the Old Testament, nobody, no prophet spoke about Jesus. No, I, I pointed to him. Oh, oh my no God. prophet was oh to Jesus. God. No, I'll rectify oh my you. God. Yeah. No, rectify. <laughs> no prophet. Okay, okay. No, time. all the it's prophets in the Old Testament. It's my time. It's my time. No, no, that prophet was time. Jesus. Boss, it's my yeah, time. Yeah, no, but don't lie. Don't lie. I'm not lying. No, you I said it. You're there. Then he himself, I said, show me. He himself read the Bible. You lied to me. And he said that that son that is going to be born is God, mighty God. No, no. Are you <laughs> second? He himself read it. People said you read. People had you read it. He, I'm sure if you're born person about that, had you read it. You can read it again if you want okay, to. Okay, let me But don't even go there. No, then go. in Daniel, let me move to another prophet. I've quoted two prophets. Then let's go to Daniel. Daniel chapter 3, Daniel chapter 7, verse 13. I was watching in the night visions. And behold, one like the son of man, one like the son of man, coming with the clouds in the in the heavens. He came to the ancient of days, and they and they brought him and they brought him near before him. Then to him he was given the he was given dominion and glory and the and, and the kingdom and all the peoples, nation, languages shall serve him shall save him shall save him shall save him you know you can pick and choose what you want to pick and choose and run around and dance around and skip about it and dance around it but you see the bible should be read in totality you've been quoting things bit here and misunderstand it bit there and misunderstand it don't talk don't talk don't talk i'm not talking yeah so don't talk i'm warning you don't talk but you see, when the truth comes to hit you, when the truth comes to hit you, you'll be jumping and skipping. You said no prophet in the Old Testament spoke about Jesus. I quoted Genesis to you. You are running away. I quoted Psalm, Psalm 110 to you. You are running away. I've quoted Daniel to you. You are running away. Then let me even cloud, let me finish it off for you. When David, when David sinned against God and he went to God for forgiveness of sin, do you know what David said in Psalm 53? Take not their Holy Spirit away from me, but restore unto me the joy of your salvation. So that means if the Holy Spirit is not with you, you have no salvation. He says, take not the Holy Spirit away from me. That was where in Psalms. Why are you so angry? I'm not angry. 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 You stop the debate. I don't want you to go down. Go, 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 go. I'm sure you don't go, go. know I can shout. Okay, yeah. <laughs> but he said, Restore unto me the joy of your salvation. My brother, you don't have the Holy Spirit, so you don't have salvation. I invite the Holy Spirit into your life, then you will get salvation. Okay? So what you are saying, you are just skipping and jumping, but you don't even know the full word. You claim you know the whole Bible. And you are you attend the whole world, you are a philosopher in the Bible, you know everything in the Bible. Today look at you, you could not even explain what Azar Na is. When you read it, it says mighty God. How can a son, a child that is born, be a mighty God? It's in the Quran. It's it's in the Bible, and here you can't explain to explain to me why a, a child born is a mighty God. If it is, look, you're shouting empty barrels makes the most sound. As a nine six, let's go back there, brother. Can you? Can you I, 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 what is your comprehension? Now I want to engage now. I will. Yeah, I, I want to read it slowly. As a nine six, so they understand. Can you read it yourself? Can you read loud? The viewers are seeing it. Shall can we, I read it? Read it. Read it. Read it. As a nine six. Yeah. For unto us a child. Is born. Yes. A child is born. Finish it. So now we want to see the attributes of that child. Finish it. Right. No, 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 explain it. Finish it. Let me see. Don't explain it. <laughs> nice is it. Right. jump. Was like, there. You go nice as a nine six. Nice went back. Went back. Yeah. Take your time. Yes. Cal calm down. For unto us a child, a child. Yeah, gone. A child is born. Yeah. To us a son is given. Got a it. son is yeah. given. Yeah. And the government will be upon his shoulders. So there. So, oh, okay, okay, no, no. With government, no, no. One by one by one. I want to know one by one. Which government was on Jesus' shoulder when he was on the earth? Tell me first. One by one by one. I want to teach you. Who brought the kingdom? No, no. Who brought the kingdom? Who brought the kingdom? We live in the kingdom. This world is not my kingdom. We live in the kingdom. No. Jesus said, This world is not my kingdom. Ah, we live in the kingdom of God. No, no. You are believing the kingdom. What Christians no. believe you are living in this kingdom me. now? Listen to me. We Christians believe you are living in this kingdom. No, that's why he's from no. uh, Asia. No. No, 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 he's my brother. No, no, he knows the same no, kingdom. When Jesus, no, <laughs> listen, wait, 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 w
not as <laughs> when Jesus was on the earth. Which government? Because the, wait, wait, you are laughing. Wait, wait, my turn. I'm, I want you to understand it. Because he said, I got it wrong. Oh, you want to understand? No, I want as you, you to understand. Teach you. No, you, I say you to understand. Since you are teaching me, you yes. tell me. You're, wait, wait. You are wait. teaching okay, me, okay, you okay, tell me. Here. Look, look. <laughs> Yeah, when Jesus was on the earth, yeah, no government was, was in his shoulder. Remember, he was running away from the Romans. And remember the verse said, remember the verse said, remember the verse said, he will be called mighty God, everlasting father. Do you know what everlasting father said? Do you know what? Listen to me. You haven't studied your Bible. Wait, wait. Look, when you read your Bible, in the Gospel of Matthew, Gospel of Matthew, chapter number 23, verse number 9, Jesus said, and do not call anyone on the earth father for you have one father as he and he's in heaven and when jesus was on the earth when, when, did, when did he say that he was on the earth you said jesus is the father you are blaspheming no way you, you, look you said no 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 i said you said this verse you According to you, according, according to you, this, according to you, Bible is no, no, not me. according to I'm you, I'm only in the Bible. This is not, this is talking about King Hezekiah. This oh. verse, li, li, Hezekiah is the king, he's the father. Do you know the story about King Hezekiah? So you know Hezekiah story? is God. Do you know the story? So no. King Hezekiah is God. Listen to me, there's a story behind it, you don't know. This guy has been studied nothing, they are clueless. Now, what I'm asking you, what I'm asking you, the verse, as a 9 6 is, as a 9 6 is a prophecy, you know. Now he said, he will be called. Show me, I'm asking you. He will be called you know, Isaiah. You know, Isaiah, the, how many years is there between Isaiah and Jesus? It's a prophecy. The son will be called mighty God, everlasting father. He will be called. I'm asking you, show me a single verse where anybody called Jesus mighty God or everlasting father. You can't. And I told you, can't. It's not even, come and show me. Nowhere in the Bible. No, 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 no. He's stopping himself. No, listen, 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 listen to me. He's stopping listen, himself. Listen to me. Let listen to me. Continue. These guys, you, you said, look, I'm quoting the verse to you. I'm even quoting what Jesus said in the Bible. You are jumping even the old. I said, I said, and you lied about me. I said, God, show me a single prophet in the Old Testament who worshiped Jesus or knew anything about Trinity. That's what I said. Mm -hmm. You can't show me. Mm -hmm. I didn't say name of Jesus. Any of the prophets in the Old Testament who worship Jesus or knew anything about the Father is God, the Son is God, and he's failed miserably and he's lying about me. You are lying. You are lying. Yeah. You go. You can't. Yeah. You can't. No, no, the prophets. No prophet in the Old Testament knew anything about Jesus being God. See, it's my, not there. Show me. my country, when you don't have a story to say, you talk plenty. No, no, show but me the proof. I don't even use all my time. Proof. This man, I'm using his own Bible, the Bible he brought himself. Yeah. And in his Bible that he brought, that he's welding it around like a sword to beat people around and to make himself look bigger than he actually is. This one Bible says that Read a child will be born. Read all of this. And that child will become mighty God. Uh, yeah, thank so you. That child <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Comprehension. So, so that child. You don't understand English. No, I'm getting you upset want, now. Do you want crossfire? No, because we. Do you want crossfire? I'm getting upset. I can prove to you I can shout better than you. So do you want crossfire? Yeah, he will be born. Do you want crossfire? Go, go, go. Do you want crossfire? No, I don't crossfire. Do you want crossfire? Go, go. Because I can shout harder than you. Because we're wasting our time. We're wasting our time. As I said, he will be called. I can shout harder than you. Okay, show me then. Pro prove it to me. I can show her that. Okay, than prove you. it to me. So, uh, with all due respect, one verse, keep Jesus quiet. will be called. Show just, me who just, called him. Just, a mighty call, everlasting father. Show just, me. Just keep, I keep quiet. Okay, just go. Keep show me. Very good. Let's In move on. In his own Bible, he said a child that is going to be born is mighty God. So, that means if you believe the Bible as your Quran says, believe the Bible. Right, your own Quran says believe in the Bible. You see the ignorance. You see the ignorance. Okay, I'll no, go, 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 And I'll finish with my, with, with my voice alone. <laughs> I can promise you that. No. All right, so. I'm a Mandinka, you know. So, uh, <laughs> don't, don't go. Mandinka is nothing. We're not in Africa. The white of West Africa. And in Africa, we know who are the big bosses there. Who are the big bosses? Mandinkas are not. Mandinkas are not. Who are the big bosses? Who are the big bosses? They are not. Who are the big bosses? Because even. Who are the big bosses? Who are the big bosses? Just don't let me go there. Who are the big bosses? The Mandinka are not the big bosses. What, what is Mandinka? So, so, so. It's kind of entertaining me now. So, so, in in his own book. He's the big boss, bro. In his own book, that he read there's a child that is going to be mighty god and we Peter are saying that mighty god is jesus christ and not any other person because if you say other person is a mighty god it contradicts what your quran is saying that god is only one 
it contradicts yourself. Because if you say God is only one, that means as Isaiah's child, I, who's um, Ezra's child or whatever he's saying, is, is mighty God. So that means himself, himself has contradicted his, he, himself that God is the only one. And we are saying that Jesus Christ who is the mighty God. That he said no boy in the Old Testament spoke about Jesus. No, I didn't say that. You're a liar. You're not, you're, not, you're not listening. You're lying. You're a camera man. No, okay, so what do you say? You see? I, I, said, I, said, I said, I said to me, no prophet, no listen to me, I said, show me a single prophet, listen to me, uh -huh. listen again, I said it three times, show me a single prophet in the Old Testament uh -huh. who wasn't Jesus or knew anything about this trying God, okay. Father and, is God, Son is God, it's and, not there. And I told you, I told you in Genesis chapter 1 verse 26, oh, oh, wait, let wait, wait, us, wait. You know, do you want cross fire? No. I can do cross fire with you. Uh, no, 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 Create man in our image. Listen to me. That's what the Bible says. If you don't know, you can read all, read, every read. kind of. Let's put it into context. Read it. I will study your Bible. I'll, I'll give you a Bible lesson. Read it. Genesis 1 26. Go. Genesis 1 26. Read it. He saw that the Bible stole their Bible. You see, he's no, he, he, go, go. He, he's still talking. Haven't. I know. He's go. still talking. Go. He's still talking. I tell you, I can shout harder than you. And I'm warning you, this is the last one I'm giving you. Now, your next one, you will not be able to talk. Go, go, go. That's the thing. 26. I, I he says, do, I don't run away. God, then God said, Let us make man in our image, in our likeness, so that they may rule over the fish in the sea, and the birds in the sky, and over the livestock, and all the wild animals. He says, Let us. So he say, I am so, going to so, get so, my money. No, what do you understand? Let no, us. Don't close. What do you understand by that? Wait. That, that, uh, what do you mean? Let us. What, does, what do you understand? Us. Uh, I've, I've read it. Uh, it is English. I say, what does you understand? Us. What, what do you mean by us? Yeah. You're, you're, what does us mean? You're, you're, okay. We can do the okay. Wait, 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 wait. We can look for them. Look okay. us. Read the next verse. Read the next verse. <laughs> no, read the next verse. <laughs> verse number 27. Read the next verse. Verse 27. So God created mankind in his image. In his image? Yes. Go on, go on. Uh -huh. Was it in his image? And in the image of God, he created them. He created them? Uh-huh. Male and female, he, he created them. He created Who is he there? Yeah. yeah. Why did God change? So, so God changed one he was asked, and next one he was one. Why did you do it? One he was asked, and one he was one. Yeah. And you see, your misunderstanding is, is, I gave you, I gave you that. Um, no, don't go, don't go, don't go. Uh, no, 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 I'm the one talking. No, let's finish. Don't go. No, Genesis, Chapter don't go. one, verse one. It says, in the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. That word, God here, what? is Elohim. Uh, uh, Elohim here no, no. is plural. No, no, no. It's Elohim is plural. No, no. So that's what buttresses my point over here. Listen so the me. reason the word God and us is shows that it's the same person. Us and God, that's he it. can be three or one. No, let me debunk this this nonsense now because I think you haven't studied your Bible. This us there is a plural of majesty. He has nothing to listen to me. Let me finish. No, listen, listen. Why is it that? Listen. No, no, wait, 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 Chapter number 44, verse number 24. Isaiah 44, 24. No God said, I am the Lord who made all things, who alone set out the heavens, who spread the earth by myself. What is we? Listen, listen, listen to me, listen to me. Look at me. You read the Bible again. Okay? See? You read the Bible. Genesis 126. After that, after we there and us, God is using all the singular pronoun. You read the Bible. God is talking here in Hosea 11, 9. For I am God and not man. God is talking there, singular. Any verse you go to Old Testament, God is a single pronoun. I, me, by myself. You read the Bible again. God said, in your Bible, God is talking here in, in, uh, in the book of Isaiah again, chapter number 45, verse number 18. said, for this is what the Lord said. He who created the heavens is God. What, what about, what about, um... Uh, Genesis 19, where no, we, we debate. Um, okay. well, no, you're, you're debating now. We're we having a debate. We're finish it. Exactly, yeah. So, as I say, you go to the Old Testament. Almighty God in the Old Testament, there's only one Lord. Only one Lord. Even Moses, Musa alayhi salam in the Bible, Deuteronomy 6 4, said, Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God, the Lord is one. And Jesus, in your New Testament, in the Gospel of Mark, 
chapter number 12, verse number 29, say the same thing. A man came to Jesus and said to him, which is the first, listen to me, the first of all the commandments, you know what Jesus said? The first of all the commandments is, hear O Israel, the Lord our God, the Lord is one. One. It's incredible. And you know the Old Testament. I'm, 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 please, please, man. Why do you please? No, 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 no. You say Muslims are not disturbing. I can't debate with you. Please, please. No, please. Be civilized, please. Yeah? You read the Bible. They say Jesus the Savior. I've quoted this excessive life. Almighty God in the Old Testament said he is the Savior. No, Jesus. You read the Bible. In the book, the book of Exodus, chapter number 45, verse number 21 to 22. 21 to 22. Exodus, no. Isaiah 45, 21 to 22. 21 says that there is no other God. There is no other God besides me. There is no other God besides me. A righteous God and a Savior. There is no besides me. Verse number 21, he said, 22 said, turn to me and be saved, all the ends of the, of the earth, for I am God and there is no other. You tell me God changed his mind in the Old Testament, he's only one God. Nowhere in the Old Testament, why God said he's a trying God. It's not there. You are failing miserably. You are failing. You can see your face, you can't call for me the Jesus. Call me a single verse, a single verse in the Bible. Verse, a single verse why Jesus said he's going to worship me. Show me you can't. You can't. You go to obscure verses. Clear verses are there. Go. You cannot. All right. So, Listen to him. So he says, My Bible have obscured the verses. So he decides which one are major and which one are of obscure. Go to emphatic ones. Look, I said, If you come in again, you will not talk again. But we shout over you. And I can shout better than you. Go, go, go. Okay. So this is the last warning. Actually, this is the last warning. Go and talk. So in the beginning, God. And by here, the word they use is Elohim. Yeah. Amen. Elohim. Amen. Elohim. And it says the meaning of El El Elohim here is it, this is the original a prayer form based on root meaning strength. It doesn't mean that uh, 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 he, he shows that, as they say, he shows that he's royal. Then he says that it, which itself is used to refer to God, in compound like El Shaddai, Almighty God. The word El is also used to refer to false gods, so that the context determines whether Elohim means God or is better understand the gods. So he just said that the word Elohim means it's a plural word. And that's how when it comes to 26, he said also that let us create man in our image. But you see, once again, I've told you time without number. Um, Psalm 53, verse Psalm, Psalm 53, when David said, take not your holy spirit away from me the holy spirit way back in genesis the holy spirit was there the bible says that the whole the spirit of the lord who fed over the earth as as my brother said yeah. and J J david too said take not your holy spirit away from me yeah. way back david and yet you think and says that if the holy spirit leaves me i don't have salvation i don't have salvation and this gentleman sitting here, very handsome, Mandingo man, six feet tall, with very big arms and everything, is telling me that the Holy Spirit is not important. I mean, he beggars belief. Then in, then in Daniel, he says a man, like the son of man, will come down. And the whole world, the whole world would worship him. Amen. Son of man will come down. Your prophet Daniel, the one you love so much, you cherish him so much. Even your, your Muhammad loves him so much. He cherishes him so much. He respects him so much. He said that a son of man will come down. And the whole world, Iraq, Saudi Arabia, Iran, everywhere, they will worship him. And you are here denying it. I mean, you are not even afraid. You are not even afraid. You are not even scared. Of such, such a human being, then the same Isaiah who said, a, a son will come and he is God, and you are still challenging God. And then I had asked him a question, he's not answered. I asked him, Can you be righteous enough to save yourself? Can you be righteous enough that when you stand before Allah, Allah will say, You know something, Mr. Mandingo man, you are so good, you are saved. Come to heaven, come to Jannah, and come and enjoy wine and everything in, in, in Jannah. Are you, are you, can you be righteous enough? Can your righteous be pure enough that when you stand before him, yeah. you know that, yes, I'm yes, justified? Is. Answer that question. Yes, Look, this my brother here, he's clueless about the Bible. Yeah. He cannot emphatic, he cannot call any emphatic verse on the Bible. He's gone everywhere. 
I've been quoting clear verses where Jesus himself is telling you he's not God. But you, you are going everywhere. I don't know. I want you to quote what did Jesus say about himself. I went to the Old Testament and quoted God. God said the only Savior. Yeah. Turn to him alone. You understand? You read the Bible in the book of Hosea, chapter number 4, chapter number Hosea 13, 4. He said, Yet I am the Lord thy God from the land of Egypt, and thou shalt know no God but me, for there is no Savior besides me. God is emphatic. Do you tell me God changed his mind? Old Testament, all the prophets, Almighty God is our Savior. The single message that was given to them is to go and tell their people to worship the Creator, not the creation. You are so worshiping Jesus. Jesus never said he is God, never said worship me. I said, show me a single verse. Call Jesus. You can't. Call Jesus. Give me the evidence. He was on the earth, fully God, fully man, part of the Trinity. The second part of the Trinity. God the Son. Show me. God the Son is not the Bible. Fully Jesus, God, fully man is not the Jesus Bible. He's not there. Show me. Call Jesus. Father Abraham, he, 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 I can, am. he can call Jesus. Now, what, I'm gonna, what I want to ask you now, this will finish the debate. This will finish the debate. Where is Jesus now? Let's interact. Finish. Where is Jesus now? No, you cannot decide when no, to finish. No, 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 no. No, you cannot no. decide when to finish. Okay. You, you spoke first. Yo, you spoke first. This will finish the debate. You, you spoke first. This then you decide when to finish. No, this no, no. You okay, wait. I finish. Wait, wait, wait. That's what I thought okay, like I want to interact. Look, <laughs> Jesus, according to Bible, Jesus is in heaven and sitting at the right hand of God. Listen, listen, listen. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. Okay, okay. You want to know? Look, no, let me talk. Then, then who is Jesus? Jesus is God. Jesus God sitting at the right hand of God. Let me quote the verses because you don't know. Several verses I'm going to quote now. Yeah, you read the Bible. It is mentioned. I quoted it earlier on in the Gospel of uh, Luke, chapter number 22, verse number 69. Luke 22, 69 said that. And we see that the Son of Man, that is Jesus, will be seated at the right hand of the mighty God in heaven. Mighty God. You read, come on, please. Come on, I told you, man, please. You read the Bible. No, please, please. If you want to debate with me later on. No, no, okay, I can debate with you. No, if you want, I don't go anywhere. I debate with you. But please, you read the Bible again. It is mentioned in the Gospel of Mark. Gospel of Mark, chapter number 16, verse number 19. Say that after he said, after the Lord Jesus has spoken to them, he was taken up into heaven. He sat at the right hand of God. Who is sitting at the right hand of God? I want to know in heaven. And guess what? In heaven, in heaven, Jesus is saying in the book of Revelation, when he's supposed to be one with God, now in heaven. Revelation, he's telling you he has a God. Let me read it. Revelation 3, 12. Look at what Jesus said. Yeah. Revelation 3, 12. Hold on. 3, 12. Let me see. Revelation 3, 12. Uh, sorry. 12. Revelation 3, 12. See that? God, Jesus is talking here. The one who is victorious, the one who is victorious, I will make a pillar in the temple of my God. Never again will they leave it. I will write on them the name of my God. That's Jesus right. is talking. And the name of the city of my God, the new Jerusalem, which is coming down out of heaven for my God. And I will also write on them my new name. Jesus on the earth. Time is up. Jesus on the earth. He said he had a God. In worship, he has a God. How can he be God? Tell me. Address it. Don't go to obscure verses. Emphatic. Call Jesus. What did Jesus say about himself? Oh, you are still talking. Yeah, go, go, go. I'll give you for, uh, uh, another minute. Uh, okay. Call Jesus another minute. Prove no, to no, us. No, no. Go. I'll give you an extra minute. I won't. Go. All right. This man obviously cannot. You see, in law, you can do everything until they tell you not to do something. So you believe that God is one. And I've proven to you areas that is contradicting your thought process, it's contradicting what you know. So your job here is to tell me why those things shouldn't be in the Bible or why, or why those things should mean something different from what I'm saying. Unfortunately, anytime I present those things to you, you don't tell me. Rather go elsewhere to quote other, other things. And I'm telling you clearly that at the end of the day, I ask you a question again, that can you be righteous enough? Can you, as a human being, six foot tall, masculine, mandingo man, be righteous enough that when you stand before your Allah tomorrow on judgment day, he will look at you and say, you good and faithful servant, come to me. You never answer that question. That's a very important personal salvation question. You run away from it. And whether you are... Can I answer, can answer it now? No, you didn't answer. You had a, a chance. You had four no, minutes no, and you were no. rather talking rubbish. Okay, go on. You see, go. that is the problem that, 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 that you have. Go. Then secondly, for me as a human being, 
right? I know somebody will come and judge me tomorrow. Somebody will come and judge my actions tomorrow. And it's the person I'm appealing to for all of you. That person who will judge you is the person I'm telling you that look up to him. Because if you go to court, you look at the judge. He's the one that will decide whether you should be killed or you should go back home and sleep in your bed. There's only one person. He's the judge. And the judge here, he's saying, look, he's coming with the clouds. And every eye will see him. And even those who pierced him, even those who pierced him, they will all see him. And all the peoples on earth would mourn because of him. And he shall be. Amen. That's the that's person you should fear, my brother. The person who is going to come. He's, he's going to come. It says even those who killed him, those who thought they had power by him, they will all see him. And he's come to judge all of you. He's come to judge all of you. He's the one you should fear. My brothers and sisters, fear him. Go to him. Ask him to say, forgive me. Save me. Because I've said over and over that the, in some again, my Lord said to my Lord, he's not been able to survive it. I told again in Psalm 53, when um, uh, David said, take not your Holy Spirit away from me. He's not even gone there at all because he doesn't got answers to that. He probably this is the first time he probably have heard that. <laughs> He's not even seen it. Uh, and I'm telling you that know. even if David in those times knew that without, without the Holy Spirit, he has no salvation. Who are you? Who are you? David, Dawood, Dawood, said, finish, said finish, not, finish. don't talk to me. It's just finished now. Don't talk to me. You, you had extra, extra minutes. No, it's finished. Extra, extra minutes. You had extra minutes. You had extra minutes. You are not going no, to I tell me. You have extra minutes. I was asking. Oh, the, 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 go, go, go. You are saying, you want to preach him on God. Go, preach. He said, Dawood said, Take not your Holy Spirit away from me. Who are you to ignore the Holy Spirit? If Prophet Dawood himself is afraid that the Father will take the Holy Spirit away from him, who are you to ignore him? I'm done. Yeah. And See, now you can do the first My prosper. brother, you are failing. This guy is you failing. Do he, no, he, he's, 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 he's failing, he's he's failing miserably here. Thanks. That's why I say, I say not tell the people, I'm going to give you Bible lessons. And you can see, you are here, here, here. You can't call Jesus. Look at your laugh. Call, it's embarrassing. <laughs> my, Ghanaian, my Ghanaian Christians, this man here from Ghana is empty. He cannot call from the Bible. You cannot call. What did Jesus have said? Jesus never said, he's God. Never said, God. I told you, Allah is God. I call, so the, call the, so the class. I can call extensively. I call in the Bible. In the Quran, Allah is, he created everything. You cannot call. God, you cannot. What did Jesus say? He never said it's God. He never said worship me. You cannot from Jesus. I'm telling you, he can't. No, a single verse in the Bible why Jesus demonstrated divinity. Oh, in God, you are worshiping. You know what he said? God, Jesus said they worship him in vain. Jesus said in the Bible, in your Bible, in the Gospel of Matthew, chapter 15, verse number 9, they worship me. They, you, he's talking to you, they worship me in vain. Following the commandments of men. You are following Paul. Paul is the one telling all these things. Do you know? The biggest writer of the New Testament. The New Testament has what? He doesn't even know. 27 books. Paul wrote half of it. And he never made yeah, he never made Jesus from the book of uh, Romans to Philemon. 13 to 14 books. You take Paul's uh, books out of your, 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 your Bible, you are, you are left with nothing. Paul and John. But Almighty God in the Old Testament is telling you he's only one God. Worship him alone. In the book of Isaiah, chapter 43, verse number 10 to 11. Before me, no God was formed. No shall there be any after me. I am the God. Besides me, there is no Savior. My brother, what's wrong with you? You are following the church fathers. If you die on that, you go to hellfire. Jesus was a Muslim. All the prophets were Muslims. They all submitted away to Almighty God. You know, Jesus said, Worship the Lord your God and serve only Him. Do you know that in the Bible? Call Jesus. In this, in the Gospel of Matthew, Gospel of Matthew, chapter number 4, verse number 10. Worship the Lord your God and serve only Him. Same message repeated in the in Gospel of Luke. Chapter number 4, verse number 8. Worship the Lord your God and serve only Him. You are worshiping Jesus. You are doing it. Yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly, exactly. When you go, exactly. That's, that's why we said you are following Paul. Paul, if you want to do a salvation, what did Paul said In the book of Romans, chapter number, book of Romans, chapter number 10, verse number 9. Romans 10, 9. Paul said that if you confess with your mouth that Jesus is the Lord and believe in your heart that God raised Him from dead, you will be saved. Paul, you are following. But what did Jesus say? When a man came to Jesus and asked Jesus, 
good master, what is the what is uh, uh, what is the first thing I shall do to, to have eternal life? You read this in the Gospel of Matthew, chapter number 19, verse number 16, 17. He came, a man came to Jesus, said, Good master, what good things shall I do that I may have eternal life? Verse number 17, what Jesus said, Why do you call me good? There is no good but one which is God. If you want to enter life, obey the commandments. Emphatic. Jesus never said to him, if you want to go to heaven, believe that I am God. Uh, believe that I died on the cross for your sins. He, he cannot call from Jesus. Now I'm going to call God. I'm just finishing. Just call God. God. All right, all right. Give up evidence. See, once again, this is the third time I've asked the same question. Can you be righteous you. enough? Sorry, Can you be righteous enough? Can you be righteous enough by yourself and stand before the holy throne of Allah and tell him that, you know something, whilst on, I was on earth, I was righteous, pure enough for you. So let me into Jannah. This is the third time I'm asking that question. He's not been able to answer that. No, no, I'm not talking to you. I don't know what you're talking about. I can't tell you now. I can't tell you now. No, forget it. When you can't tell you now. When you get to a time. No, you've been caught here. I've forgotten about it. I want you to go. One minute. When you get to a time, you answer it. Come on, come on. One minute. I can't better than you. Come on, then. You're being a fool. I'm angry. I'm angry. You're being a fool. I'm saying I can't tell you better than you. You can't tell you better than me. I can't tell you better than you. Yeah, yeah, go on, go on. You're being exposed. I'm angry. You're being exposed. I'm not angry. Because they expose you. Yeah, yeah, no. Yeah, look at your laugh. Your laugh said it. You're exposed. You can't quote anything. Call Jesus, uh, go! All right. I've told you again. We can't, again, I can't believe it. That Jesus Christ said, I and my father are one. Thank you. Meanwhile, in Islam, meanwhile, in Islam, do you have a father? Can you call Allah your father? I'm asking you, can you? In, in, can you ask a Muslim, can you call Allah your father? Can you call him your father? Can you call Allah, 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 Allah your father? No, I'm asking you. I'm only, I'm, no, 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 I, I know you're Muslim. No, no, go, no, no, ask me. Go. Can you call Allah? Go. Don't run, don't run. Allah your don't run away. Don't, don't run away. You can't, you, you can't call Allah, Allah your father. But who gave Jesus Christ authority to call Allah his father? Who gave Allah and Jesus Christ authority to call Allah his, his father? Secondly, too, and I've said again, I don't think we'll take too much of the time. He said, before Abraham, the father of the Jewish people, I am. And the same I am is the same thing that Moses saw in the burning bush. And the Bible, they said that Moses saw God in the burning bush. You can go and check again. He said he saw God in the burning bush. And that burning bush said that I am that I am sent to. So if Jesus Christ said that before Abraham, I am. That means before the father that you guys respect so much, I was there. And I am. And again, it says that me, I and the father are one. What again evidence do you need? You don't need any, any, any more evidence. Except the fact that. The question that I ask you, you've not been able to address any of them, and you are jumping and jumping and jumping, going here and there and going here and there. Thank you. Go to finish. Go to finish. You finish it. I'm done. You know, you know. You see the debate. The debate now. I didn't even ask him any question. The debate about the concept of God in Islam versus the concept of God in Christianity. I haven't even asked any question. But you're feeling miserably. I said, "Call Jesus." You said, "Jesus is God." The man came on the earth. He preached extensively. Yeah. He called. He called the Jews back. To the way of what Moses told them, oneness of God. He never said he's God. He never said worship me. Right. Yeah, you, yeah. So you cannot. You are failing miserably. I gave you chance upon chance. Call Jesus to me. You can't. Now look. Do you know why? Look, the Jews were the Jews were the first people to call God Father. Do you know why? There, here. You can hear in Isaiah 64 8. You know what I said? Mm -hmm. Yet you, Lord, are our Father. Mm -hmm. We are the clay, you are the potter. We mm -hmm. are all the work of your hand. Mm -hmm. Why the Trinity? Mm -hmm. Father mm -hmm. means rap. Mm -hmm. Our creator, sustainer. Nothing else. You see that? Oh, the Jews and as I see, can you read it? Yeah. Do you know this verse? Have you, have you come across this verse? I have. 
No, you haven't. I have. What, read. What, 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 what do you no, say? So the you question, have already heard. Let me see. I asked you that question. No. You asked yeah. a question. Let me, yeah. let, let me answer yeah. you. Let me. As you ask a Muslim, can you call Allah your, let, your father? Let, let me finish. Let, let, let me can finish. you call Allah your father? Leave it. 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 Allah, so exactly, exactly, exactly. Even the Bible, even the Bible, the Old Testament telling you the Jews <laughs> were the first people before you to call God Father. That Father just means Creator. He's here. I Look, as, let me let me see. Let me, in my, in my turn. Isaiah 64. <laughs> when we count, I tell you why. I, go, go, I tell you why. Okay, call Allah. I tell you, I, I tell you say, why. Say, say Allah is my father. I tell you say why. It, say it. See, be stupid. Say now, it because you're exposed. Say it. Say it. You're exposed. Say, say is my father. Isaiah 64 8. Look uh -huh. at it. He said, Isaiah 64 8 said that. Uh -huh. Isaiah 64 8. Yet you, Lord, are our Father. Uh -huh. We are the clay, you are the potter. Uh -huh. We are all the work of your hand. What does uh -huh. that mean? Uh -huh. What does that mean? He says it means that they are God, Allah created them. God created them. They, they Thank you very much for watching. So you call Allah Father? I finished the debate. 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 I I asked him, is this the authentic word look, of God? Look, look, look. look, 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 look he believes the authentic word of God. No, 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 he's afraid no, because, because he can't answer the question. question. So I asked him, I asked you, do you know about everything that Allah wants I'm, I'm going now. in this it's Quran? Is this turn, yeah? Go, go. Can everything that Allah wants in this Quran in this Quran? Yeah. He wants you, it's in the Quran. Okay. So everything Allah revealed is in this Quran? Yes. So Allah revealed that the sucking of the breast in he revealed it to Mo Mohammed. That, bro. Then, unfortunately, that sucking of the breast is not in the Quran. Why, why did so get my the, question no, is... Why did you get that from first? Oh, no, no, he no, even no, showed it to no, you. No, why you... Why no, 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 you wait, 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 I didn't tell you. Sucking of breast no, no. is not in no, the Quran. Listen to me. So it doesn't bother you that it's not in the Quran. Quran is complete. Does my it brother, you? my brother, does it bother you? What do you know about the Quran? You don't know anything. <laughs> you don't even know anything about your Bible. Is, you that, is it in the Quran? Do you know the lost prayer? Quran or not? Do you know the lost prayer? Is it in the Quran or not? Do you know the lost prayer? You can't. You can't. I know for once. I said what one topic. Look, look. Is it in the Quran? No, you know. Is it in the Quran? Yeah, yes you, or no? You, you're the one that's saying it. Listen, you said it. Verify. Is it in the Quran? The Quran is here. No, 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 not the Quran. You know about the Quran? I said. Show the Quran. Allah. Say Allah revealed yes. the sucking of the breast to Muhammad. Where? 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 In the Quran? The Quran is here. In the Quran, yeah. In the Quran. Don't wonder. The Quran. Muhammad. In the Quran. Muhammad did not compile this Quran. Huh? Muhammad did not compile this Quran. The Quran was in the Wahhi. Did not compile this Quran. No, you asked a the question. Listen to me. You have. You have. Give me the Quran. You don't know. Uh, you know. Listen, listen. So, bro, this guy's a waste so, of time. So he cannot quote from so, Jesus. So, so, huh? so, He's going everywhere. Huh? Allah, he has to study his Bible, Allah but he has the audacity to question the authenticity of the Quran. Yeah, amazing. Show amazing. Read it, read it, read it, read it, read it. You read it, boy. This is a hadith. This is not in the Quran. The,
It's my turn. Wait, it's my turn now. Let me talk. And, and breastfeeding. Let me, let me talk. Was it written to Muhammad? Which was is it in the Quran? Let me, yeah. let, is it in the Quran? Of course it wait, is. Wait, wait. Uh, yeah, yeah, it's right. in the Quran. You see, it my brother here says yeah. the circle of the breast is in the Quran. Wait, wait, wait. Thank no, you very much. Wait. Breast. It said read properly. Uh, yeah. Breastfeeding yeah, yeah, of an adult. That's what it says there. So it tells you basically to the mum when she stopped feeding her son. So that's what in the Quran. If you go in the Quran, it shows that. I shows I am not you, 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 you know what you're saying. You see, you're, you're exposed now. You got your, you see what I'm saying? They go to anti Islamic way side. Now I'm going to go because it's a waste of time. You debate us, wonders of God. No, you're wasting our time. Yeah? And he felt miserable. He cannot show anywhere. He cannot show us that Jesus is God and he wasn't Jesus. You see what I mean? I quoted from the Bible. I quoted from the Quran. I quoted from the Bible. He cannot show me. I ask you. Show me for the Bible. Let me read. Let me read. Don't die. Don't die. Let me read. Let me read. Let me read. Let me read. What? All right. You cannot show anything. A verse of stoning. Can't read that city. So I'm going to go down adult. because it's ten times the debate finished. Was revealed. The debate is finished. The man who got exposed. Yeah. He cannot call for the Bible. It was revealed. Why Jesus said he's God? Why he worship me? You see what I mean? He cannot call Jesus on lips. The man was on the earth for three and or three and a, three and a half years. He taught his disciples. He never said he's God. He never said worship me. Three is a fabrication. Yeah. Jesus was not a trinitarian. No, no, the prophets ascribed his cult to trinity. Yeah, he and came later on. Almighty God is the only one Lord. Quran. So the Quran is not complete. Okay, okay. This, That's it. This guy is ignorant. It's here. Yeah, ignorant. Okay. It's a waste of time. Let's go. It's here. I say this one. It's a waste of time. So let's go. It's a waste of time. You're wasting my time. It's waste. My you're wasting my time. You can't crack on the city. You come to evidence. You come.